Hi everybody, this is Solomon Schmidt from HistoryBytes.com. Today we're going to talk about King Henry VIII. Henry VIII was born on June 28, 1491 in London, England. He was the son of King Henry VII and Queen Elizabeth of York. Henry VIII's older brother Arthur was raised to become the next King of England, while Henry was brought up to become an official in the Roman Catholic Church. However, in 1502 Arthur died and Henry became next in line for the throne. In 1509, his father, King Henry VII, died, and Henry became the next King of England. King Henry VIII was very well educated, athletic, and musical. During the early 1530s, King Henry VIII wanted to divorce his first wife, Catherine of Aragon, because she did not give birth to a son who could become the next king. Pope Clement VII refused to allow the divorce, and in 1534, King Henry, who was previously Catholic, officially separated England from the Catholic Church. King Henry was then declared to be the supreme head of the new Church of England, and this marked the beginning of the English Protestant Reformation. Sadly, when his second wife Anne Boleyn gave birth to a daughter and not a son, King Henry VIII had her executed. However, he spared the life of their baby girl, whom they named Elizabeth, and she later went on to become Queen Elizabeth I. During his reign, King Henry VIII made important changes to England's constitution, and he founded the English Navy, which eventually became known as the Royal Navy. King Henry VIII died on January 28, 1547, in London, England. He was one of the most well-known and influential monarchs in English history, partly because he had six wives, two of whom he divorced and two of whom he had executed. Three of his children later sat on the throne of England, Queen Mary I, or Bloody Mary, Queen Elizabeth I, and King Edward VI. Comment below and tell me if you know how many palaces King Henry VIII built in England during his reign. Please give this video a thumbs up, click that subscribe button, and ring the notification bell to stay up to date with all of my videos. And until next time, go learn your history.